today in the developing DeMarcus Cousins. And you know one of the things you got to love about yeah, he's checked in for Collison. Baca comes in for Perry Jones. Tabo Cephalosha has checked in for Kevin Durant. We've had him. I gotta be honest, I did not know he grew up a Raptors fan. I had no idea. I'm guessing maybe he fell in love with Vince Carter at the dunk contest. Maybe that was it, yeah. Mr. Moves passes to Perkins, and that one's good. Thanks, Golden State. And across the board in that game, they just shot the lights out. They had a fantastic offensive night. Yeah, rarely do you see a team get that hot. I didn't catch up with Doris Burke. Hey, Doris. Hey, Kevin. Mr. Moves in that last game against the Timberwolves played a role for them. He had nine points, and in addition to his scoring, he also came away with a season high for rebounds. He was just too much to handle as he came off the bench to turn in a great outing, guys. They hope it continues. All right, Doris. Well, what do you guys think? Does that kind of big performance energize a player in his next game, or has it, you know, like Steve Kubik, taken a toll physically? I think it just depends on the individual. 26 wins for them, two more than the next two teams in the conference. And the only team that had more road wins than them on, on the year in the NBA was the Heat. So just a terrific season for the Thunder, both at home and on the road. Of course, kind of got derailed by the Westbrook injury in the playoffs. And a tight game here as we end the first half. Kings lead by two. And we'll be back for the second half following the break. Keep it right here on 2K Sports. Oklahoma City's gone two of two from long range in the third quarter so far. Salmon's out there with Luke, Rashad, and Bahamuta. Then it's Vasquez. Then it's Isaiah Thomas. And it's Haynes in at the pivot spot, manning the middle. So that's the five in the game for Sacramento over. Well, you know, he almost seems to enjoy those mismatches, Steve. It gets critical in terms of outcomes of games. And the Thunder last year often had an advantage at the line. Not only did they get there at a high rate, they made their free throws at a high rate as well. I, this is what I think of when I think of him. Late in the fourth quarter, time winding him down. They've got one shot to win the game. He's your man. He's the guy I'm looking for to make it happen. And keeping us updated. For it's exciting times for the Kings fans and a lot of newfound optimism around this team, too. And he makes no mistake. And there's the pass to Mr. Moves. Shot clock at five. Oklahoma City needs to get off a shot. Hangs in the air. And it's Durant playing it in. This is going to be a great game for them. No. Thomas kicks to Cousins. No good there, and that would have cut it to single digits. So no problem for Oklahoma City as they get the win. And this one was such a lopsided victory. They never let up. They were full throttle from the start. And that'll wrap it up for Clark Kellogg, Steve Kerr, and those two cities, particularly Seattle, Kevin, are strong contenders for a new NBA franchise. Of course, Seattle almost ended up with the Sacramento Kings, but uh, when Sacramento was awarded the franchise... Well, it was the Oklahoma City Thunder winning their last game against the Kings. How about the box score from that game? The accuracy from... When in doubt, I thought that was a good call there. Right with it. Now guarded by Cephalosha. Platoon passes to Williams. Let's check out what Doris Burke has for us. Hey, Kevin, Mr. Moves in that last... Two of six in the field in the second quarter so far. Abaka with a screen on Williams. The shot's good for Mr. Moves. It's with Abaka leading the way, but they can all leap up and still get a piece of the shot. Yeah, Ibaka is the anchor, Kevin, but you look at across the land, guys like Westbrook and Durant, uh, Perkins, I mean, they get plenty of block shots, so it's, it's their Blazers on the break. Matthews leading the charge. He dishes it to Lillard. Got a piece of it. After playing a pretty solid first half. You know, guys, Portland had one of the worst benches in the history of the league last season. You know, they didn't get much contribution. 14. Here's Mr. Moves. Seven points in the game. Sinks the 15-footer. Mr. Mook can change everything. These points come on putbacks just because of sheer hustle. And something else he does that might not wind up in the stat sheet, but is still a big part of his game, his leadership defensively. Collectively, they're a much better team when he's on the floor. Nice, silky finish on the alley-oop. 
That sequence, I don't think Clark could have been executed any better. Stupendous feat. Boy, I hope we see a few more of those. Well, going back to that Thomas Robinson trade, not the best rookie season, so he begins. Back to Durant. Fires from deep. Gets it to go. Durant's got 22 points. Perkins with the screen. Here's Mr. Moves. And there's the whistle. Wasn't that the Thunder were beating teams last season? Everybody expected that. But it was then. No good on the shot. A bit long that time. He's got a nice touch on that shot normally, but good defense there clogging the lane. Back to Ibaka. And then it's no mistake on the Robinson. And the rejection by Ibaka. Watson gets to Freeland. Great D that time from Collison. Jackson. He passes to Mr. Moves. Steps back and fires. Help the bucket. Well, if it wasn't already out of reach, it is now, thanks to this spurt. Just keep on firing, man. No reason to slow down now. So no problem for Oklahoma City as they get the win. And this one was such a lopsided victory. They never let up. They were full throttle from the start. Thank you for joining us for this presentation of NBA Basketball on...